G'day, Jason here. I'm being driven by Harry, who didn't want to be in the video, but I put him in anyway, um, to our sixth and final appointment for the day at Newport, um, outside Coles, where we're going to be having another mobile office and listening to the views and seeing if there's anything we can do to help people in Newport at this end of the electorate. It's been a great day, I've got to say. We've had a fantastic response. As you can tell, um, it's a bit jerky in the van, so um, we're late in the day, and um, I promise you we have not had anything to drink other than water and coffee. So maybe it's um, you know too much caffeine that's impacting the uh, the, the um, stability of the van. But um, look, there's a lot happening in Newport at the moment. The state government's invested a lot of money. Um, federal government's got a lot of grants for the Surf Life Saving Club up there. Uh, Rob Stokes got a grant to. Um, with the help for the, from the federal government to preserve some land um, and reserve it as a nature reserve. And, and a shout out to Stuart, Councillor Stuart Sprott on that. He's the first one that pointed out that land um, and made sure that uh, we knew about it and we could, um, and we could preserve it for, as, as for you know, the next generation and in perpetuity. So an important um, contribution I think from uh, from uh, federal and state government, state in particular, but also from Stuart who saw it and brought it to our attention. So kudos, Stuart. Um, looking forward to hearing once again. You know, another big thing that's come out. Obviously, climate change has been a huge subject for us today, but transport has been coming out quite a bit. Um, there was the state government had a proposal to take the B line to Newport, uh, but there are a couple of people up there who were. Um, against that so it never went as far as Newport so it'll be interesting to see if there are any views now about extending the beeline to Newport um, look we'll be back uh, shortly to see um, to see what people had to say uh, look forward to seeing you if you're around see ya